Hello and welcome to video number two on the Knives Fast channel. Today it's going to seem like we have a trend because we do. A budget friendly folder and it is a frame lock coming up. All right, here we go with video number two. Today's knife is the Kershaw Cryo. Yes, a good old Kershaw. It is a fixed blade and it is an assisted opening knife. It's actually called the Cryo Assisted Opening Knife and it is the 1555TI. It is a Rick Hinderer design. Uh, you've probably seen this design quite a bit in some other knives, uh, but this is the Kershaw version of it. And again, it is a very affordable folder. Uh, with that drop, beautiful drop point design. It's a 2.75 inch blade and it is made of 8 CR13 MOV. Not my favorite steel, but again, it is a very solid knife. It does take an edge very well. It does seem to, uh, to lose that edge a little bit faster than I would like, but again, um, it, it is a very solid, very good working knife. I've used it a lot as an EDC. Um, and again, it is a very fun little flipper. It comes out of there like a rocket, good and smooth. Um, and again, like I said, it takes a really good edge. It is a pocket knife. As I said, I carry it as an EDC very often. Uh, I carry it tip down, but it has tip up, tip down, left and right. Uh, and it is a stainless steel handle as well as the blade. Now you might say, you know, well that's going to be very heavy. Well, it is 4.1 ounces, but if you remember uh, the SE Avispa that I recently reviewed, that's 4.4 ounces, and that's a three point, uh, that's almost an inch longer blade. Uh, so, in a 2.75 uh, inch blade, uh, 4.10 is not that bad for me. Again, I like a heavier knife sometimes because it fits nice and firmly in your hand, and you're, you know, you feel like you're holding something uh, very substantial. Um, like I said, it is spring assisted. It is designed by Rick Hinderer. Uh, it is made in China, but again, I don't really care. It's a good sharp knife um, and it's terrific for EDC tasks. I've used it actually for carving as well. Um, I've actually used it on some projects. I actually designed uh, a handle on my own custom knife and I actually used uh, this for some of the work, some of the rough work on that knife handle. Um, so anyway, just a, a really good overall knife there. You can get a little bit better look at the, at the blade and at the design. Uh, and I, again, you'll learn through these videos that I just really enjoy the sturdiness of a frame lock knife. Um, I do like, you know, uh, some of the, uh, the other types of locks, but my favorite is definitely the frame lock. And this has really good jimping. Uh, on the bottom and the top for a good hand grip as well. So again, I got this one for just under $30 of all places at Walmart. Um, but again, you can get them just about anywhere for about that dollar figure. Uh, so again, go try it out. Great knife. Enjoy.